Let's take a trip back in time to the world's biggest air show, EAA Air Venture, in the summer of 2014. Every year, hundreds of thousands of people gather to see the latest and greatest in aviation. But that year, they were about to witness something special. A tiny, single-seat jet, so new it had only made its first flight just days before, was about to make its public debut. This is the story of how the Sonex Subsonex JSX-2 personal jet stole the show. So what exactly is the Subsonex? It's a personal jet, but not a big corporate one. This is a small, single-seat jet that you can build yourself from a kit. The model everyone was waiting to see was the JSX-2, a refined and updated version. The pressure was on the Sonex aircraft team. The JSX-2 had its very first flight on July 10, 2014. Just a few weeks later, it was scheduled to fly in front of the entire aviation world. Those first few flights were all about the basics, testing the controls, checking the systems, and making sure the landing gear worked perfectly. The team had to be sure this brand new jet was safe and ready before its big moment in the spotlight. Then the moment arrived. At the controls was legendary airshow pilot Bob Carlton. As the tiny jet screamed past the crowd for the first time, you could immediately see its potential. But the real magic was about to happen. On his next pass, Bob Carlton retracted the landing gear. The effect was instant. The jet became noticeably quieter, and with less drag, it accelerated with incredible speed. It was like watching a sports car hit the nitrous butt. This single action showed everyone just how sleek and efficient the jet's design truly was. Bob himself described the jet as feeling fast and smooth with a great climb rate. But he wasn't done yet. To prove this was more than just a speed machine, Carlton even performed a few graceful barrel rolls. He showcased that this little jet wasn't just fast, it was agile and fully capable of aerobatics. The crowd was blown away. This demonstration was so important because it showed the evolution of the project. The JSX-2 was a huge improvement over the original prototype. This performance at AirVenture was the moment the Subsonex went from being a cool idea to a polished, capable aircraft that people could see and believe in. It proved that the dream of owning and flying your own personal jet was becoming a reality. The flybys at AirVenture 2014 cemented the Subsonex JSX-2's place in the hearts of aviation fans. It was a bold, last-minute debut that perfectly captured the spirit of innovation and excitement that makes airshows so special. What do you think of the Subsonex? Could you see yourself flying your own personal jet? Let us know down in the comments. If you enjoyed this look back at aviation history, be sure to give the video a like and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching.